and welcome. Today is the 9th of April 2019, 19.37 local time. Uh, in this video, we'll do something I haven't done for a while, so rather than, you know, uh, predicting markets or documenting trades or explaining, you know, like uh, certain aspects of the market causality, I will just give an overview, a market overview. So let's start. We look at H4 charts. This is Euro dollar. You can see it came up nicely and both shorties were basically hunted. Um, so even though we have more stops on the upside, you see that all these longings are on the way. So I would think that, you know, Euro dollar from here should come down and, you know, go for some of those empties around the 1.1253 level. That would be the base case. Um, this is Australian dollar on the upper side of a consolidation on the forward chart took out upper stops so also rather bearish could do a reverse trader pattern and go for this stop accumulation at the 0 0.71046 level but the bias is not very strong there um, i do not trade any cable pairs at the moment because of the brexit situation this first needs to you know be sorted but this is cable anyways so you can see, you know, around this level here, around the 1.308 level, there are the money longies. So that's why they're going down now. The smart money algos are, you know, pushing uh, down the price against these longies from last week as well. So rather bearish, but not really tradable. Same for EG. Uh, going for the upper stops, but tradability is not very high. Uh, because of, you know, there can be a huge spike just on the basis of a Brexit comment. So we avoid that. Let's look at dollar yen. Dollar yen after this multi week uptrend now did a breather down as expected. Some long is there which are hunted. Um, so, you know, once uh, the lower stops have been cleaned, maybe there is some long opportunity there at some point. <coughs> Pound yen is a pound pair, so we skip it as well. Euro yen, you see below the price there are shorties. So at some point, you know, uh, Euro yen could turn, but this is not tradable. There are stops on both sides and the down money flow is too low. So skip. Let's look at the uh, Kiwi dollar. Right here. So Kiwi dollar. Went down over weeks against all these longies, business as usual. So, you know, that money tried to buy again and again and again. And as a result, smart money algos pushed down the price and the downtrend is a result. So above the price of long So bearish. Kiwi dollar is pretty bearish. We we'll probably take out the low once more. Looking at all the longies there. But, you know, it's uh, an outer range scenario. But bearish. Um, so look at dollar cut. Dollar cut, pretty neutral. Some shorties, some longies. Middle of the range, nothing to do there at the moment. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for now. So yeah, let's see what happens. Euro dollar bearish in the short term. Same with Kiwi dollar. Stay safe.